to make you look skinnier for each body part it can literally make you look like a korean superstar by using this beauty feature hi guys wing Hon here in this video i will share some of the main video editing features between filmora and also capcut so that you guys can pick which one that's best suit your video editing requirement now let's go before we start do not forget to subscribe to this youtube channel first is speech to text this feature is getting hot in demand let's look at filmora first so let's try their speech to text features Let's look at Filmora first. So let's try. As you can see, the speech and the text is barely matches actually. Maybe it's my Asian accent. Let's look at Filmora first. So let's try their speech to text features. It is just bad. Next, the price is sitting at USD $4.99 per month for an hour speech to text. This also means that apart from the money fees that you pay, you need to pay additional $4.99 per month. Next, let's look at CapCut. Let's try their speech to text features. A few moments later. Hi guys, Wing Hon here. In this video, I will share some of the main video editing features between Filmora and also CapCut so that you guys can pick which one that's best suit your video editing requirement now let's go this youtube channel first is speech to text this feature is getting hot so as you can see over here the text is pretty well synced compared to filmora let's look at the pricing capcut is literally free to use but speech to text fall under their pro features and it is $7.99, $7.99. And with this price, you get to unlock all of CapCut Pro features, which I think is pretty worth for the price. Next, effect and also transitions. In general, I quite like Filmora's effect and also transitions. It has everything that I need. But the things that I don't really like is the pricing. And some of the effects fall under the premium category, even though I already pay for Filmora but I still need to upgrade to use some of their premium effect well I'm cool with it before I know about CapCut so with CapCut of course the premium one you know we have to pay too I'm okay with that as I only need to pay pro memberships one time every month then I can access everything in CapCut and in furthermore in CapCut you can get to use a lot of trending effect that you saw in TikTok video and I'm no surprise on this as CapCut is part of TikTok. Next, beauty features. So one of the features that stand out with CapCut is their beauty features. It can literally make you look like a Korean superstar by using these beauty features. And also, it has features to make you look skinnier for each body part, as you can see over here. And also put makeup on you, such as lipstick. And the best part is that you do not need to pay any extra money when you are already is a CapCut Pro members. In short, I have been using Filmora for about three years plus now. And one of the reasons I choose to use CapCut is because I create and I edit a lot of TikTok videos. And CapCut feature is awesome for editing CapCut video. And for sure, the price is affordable for all of the features that I get in CapCut. All right, so will you choose CapCut over Filmora or vice versa? Comment below this video. 